today I feel more like slightly doubting myself or maybe kind of don't want to do something it's because of yesterday now I know you're like wait what yesterday was awesome Th that's exactly why because yesterday was the first time that I did a video in Taiwan with somebody what I want to deliver is video content like that me and somebody for us, like showing the adventure through both of our perspective not everything just me 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 I'm not just talking about me but I'm just saying everything is just kind of through my perspective my thing I'm with the camera like this hey what's up everybody you know what I mean yesterday was more like hey it's us it was more like a conversation like you know I had this yesterday and hey Hey, what was that thing that you said the other day that you didn't want me to to eat? No, not that one. I'm talking about the other one, right? Yeah, 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 the pork. The pork, I'm telling you, the pork was, ooh. You see, that's more real for me. That's more conversational. That's more real life. The reason why I'm doing this here by myself rather than waiting is because of just that. I don't want to be waiting on people. You know, this is what I want to do. This is my circumstances now. And even though it's not ideal, it's a start. It's a start. You know, it's definitely not where I want to end up. I want to end up where it's like I have a, not a crew, but I have other people coming with me. You know, we're all, like all of us on the experience. You are traveling with us, but that's exactly it. You're traveling with us. Not necessarily just traveling with me. And so that creates a totally awesome experience. And that's what I want to deliver. Anyways, that, that's, that's just kind of my thoughts. And that's probably the reason why I'm feeling down because it was such an awesome video yesterday. And now I'm going back from that awesomeness, that level that I want to be at. And then now I have to go back to level one. Just me. Hey, what's up everybody? You know what I mean? So let me know your thoughts on that as well. And uh, I'd love to hear from you, okay? As you go down, you'll see this little small shop and they make like this pancake-like sweet and it has filling inside. They have cream, um, red beans, peanuts, taro, and an assortment of different ones. They don't have chocolate, I asked them, I was like, ah! So I got the cream instead. And when you open it apart, you can see how much filling it actually has inside. Okay, it definitely tastes like a pancake. 100% soft, fluffy, slightly crunchy on the edges right here. Pancake. Personally for me, the thing that really brings me to like it is the cream. The cream is perfect. It, it infuses everything with the pancake. So not far from here, just kind of like a few steps away from that little small uh, shop is another uh, pastry shop. This right here, I don't know what it is. They do have a sample here. This is gonna be 100% biased. I don't like red azuki beans. It has red azuki beans. So now you know. So they just have an array of different types of breads, sweet breads, savory, um, you know, garlic bread, just regular bread, plain bread, sweet bread, not sweet bread, uh, you know, just traditional Taiwanese um, snacks, little like cupcake things with cream and cakes. Okay, so we are done there. I'm at Zhongxiao Fuxing and I'm gonna go to the technology building, get out of here, and then walk to find the one lung station so I could go to Xinjiang. The reason why I'm doing this is because I really don't want to go from Zhongxiao Fuxing all the way to Ximen and then transfer and then go all the way to Xinjiang. This looks much quicker. Another journey has begun. Green Line Station. Where 
are you? Excuse me. Do you know where's one line station? One MRT Green Line. Green Line? Yeah. Goes a straight. Straight. Very straight. Very straight. Very straight. Good. And uh, you can see the Taida, and uh, you 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 will see a Green Line. Okay, perfect. Yeah. Xu Xu Lin. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Have a nice day. You too. Okay, so they helped me over there. I have to go straight, and as as he said, very straight. So I actually just bumped into this small shop here. Again, it is almost Chinese New Year. And it's so colorful. You see everything. You see the red envelopes. You see like ornaments. And just everything kind of ready for the Chinese New Year. As I was walking, I saw this little shop. And I saw the bento boxes. I just picked the one that had like the pork belly inside. So it has pork belly, uh, a sausage, uh, spinach, egg, lettuce, rice and tofu. The main challenge that you're gonna face with this bento box is where do I start? Pork belly. That was real soft. I was expecting it to be kind of chewy. Oh my goodness, it's so creamy. That pork belly is so creamy. Let me try the tofu with the rice by itself. It tastes similar to an omelet. It has like a nice, a nice skin layer to it. Ugh, that sounds nasty, right? Ah, I don't think I'm doing the best explanation. It's sweet. I wonder if this is a mango. Spinach and the rice. It's a little sausage. That's a very juicy and flavorful sausage. I'm gonna finish this off, and then we'll be on our way. Now at Taiwan National University, and I'm still going super straight. Excuse me. Do you know where's Wan Lan? Wan Long. Yes. Wan Long. I... Wan Long. Anything that's green. Okay. Yeah. The Gongguan Station is next to the gate of this university. Xie Xie Nin. I just now need to go straight. A different type of straight. This type of straight over there, which is actually a right. So I've been walking for about an hour and they have just been, you know, just building after building after building. Then, oh my goodness, then I saw this spot over here. Look at all those hills. I mean, you couldn't even kind of see a temple kind of like covered a bit by the trees. And there's a guy, he's actually on the water going to who knows where. And it's just, oh, wow. It just looks so, I actually think there's a hot springs over there because I see smoke. I'm gonna go down this corner and see if there's a way for me to get to that side. I didn't think it was possible, but I actually made it down here. Compared to the suspension bridge in Nehu, this one is more wobbly. You're not gonna 
believe it. Remember that restaurant we went to yesterday at Elon where we had dumplings before we went to the beach? They have it here. So I got myself one dumpling. And I went there and I was like, I only want one. And she was like, one? We don't be serving no one. You need to get ten. One. Now she didn't say that and she didn't say it in English. But her face said that. Right now I'm going up Hume Mountain. I could feel the sweat already coming. It's like, Linda, we're going to be coming in like five minutes. If you keep on, don't be complaining. As I'm going up these steps, I'm looking around me and it feels like I'm in a video game. I'm like, dang, this better not be Assassin's Creed and people be jumping on me, trying to attack me because I'm going to be out of breath already. I ain't know how I'm going to save myself. I'm going to have this camera. They're going to take it away from me. I'm going to stop screaming. I'm going to take my chancla off. I don't have a chancla. I'm going to take my sneak off. I'm going to throw it. I'm going to miss. I'm going to scream again. I'm going to try to jump over, but I can't do it because I'm scared of heights. I don't want to think about it. Let's just keep going. I get scared in places like this because it's just me by myself walking around some woods, some forest, all green everywhere. I don't know what could come at me. Maybe an animal, maybe an insect, maybe a snake. Maybe, it's, I don't, that's the point. I don't know. I'm telling you, if there was just one person, one person here, easy. I'd be fine because I know, because I know that they probably know the area and they're not foolish. Here's the thing, okay, hold on, you know what? <laughs> I had enough of this place. You know, evening is approaching, it came to my mind that, you know, maybe the locals don't come in the evening for a reason. So, <laughs> it's nice, it's awesome. But, I think my non-prayer has just been answered. As I was coming down, look, did I not just say less than two minutes ago? If there was at least one person, I'd be fine and cool. Now I'm fine and cool. the only one huffing and puffing. Thanks to that guy, I made it to the top. I don't know where he went. I'm just staying up here now. But I just noticed something, look. That suspension bridge. I was there. Remember I was there next to the rocks looking at the hill saying, oh that's so awesome. Now I'm on the hill. I didn't even realize that until I come up here and I see the suspension bridge. I'm like, oh, snap. So I'm like, whoa, I, 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 I don't know what to say. I might have lost for words. Uh, as you can see, evening has approached, and so I'm gonna be heading down the mountain. Now that I got off the suspension bridge, there seems to be a lot of, lot of food shops around here, so I'm gonna check a few out. I just bumped into this place, and when I saw the Bowser that they were making, I was like, ooh, I have to have one. And so I got one, I got a pork one. What's really great, honestly, is the honesty. She told me the price, because they didn't have the price, and so I gave her 30 Taiwanese dollars and she was like, no, 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 no. And she gave me the 20, she took the 10 Taiwanese dollars. Like she could have just ripped me off right then and there, you know, but she didn't. That was, that was pretty awesome. It's funny, I'm testing right now and the guy behind me is just looking at me. You see, look at, look at that, <laughs> you see? As I was walking, I saw this place and I saw the noodles and I was like, oh my goodness, I want to try the noodles. So I got the noodles and the lady was like, oh, you have to try the judo fun, judo fun. So, and then I saw kind of like this salad dish. In a way, it had like tofu and seaweed and some like odd pink thing and I pointed and I was like, that too. Now for the noodles that I really came here for. Actually, I don't think, I don't think this is the same noodles that I saw. Ah oh, man, I hope she didn't get, I think she got confused. Okay, let's try it anyway. 
It's kind of all like together and kind of sticky a bit. A little slightly slimy the texture, which I'm not fond of. Let me try the judo font. Mm. This one's good. I love it when it's creamy. The only time I had judo font or, or pork with rice when it's creamy was when I was in Raho Market. Here's the one. I'm going to try the pork. This this pork with the rice. Mm. Mm. That's a that's a whoa, what just happened? Okay, I'm gonna try the pork by itself. It kind of tastes a little bit like salami. For me it's okay because it kind of tastes like salami. I'm not a big fan of salami. The best one here is the rice with pork. I wasn't even gonna order this. Let me know which one that you think is the most delicious. I'm gonna finish this up and I'll see you in a bit. Today was such a tough and crazy day, wasn't it? I mean, you know, when I first started the day, it was, it was tough to begin with for reasons you know why that I explained at the beginning. I was like, just keep on, keep on. Maybe you'll see something and then I saw you know that those hills and then I went over there and then I saw the mountain and then I saw the suspension bridge and then I saw the food and then and then everything just went through because I pulled through I kept pushing on even when I didn't feel like it I'm so proud of myself I'm I'm very glad about that so that's what I'm saying it's been a tough interesting great wow day okay so I'm gonna wrap it up for today and uh, I will see you on the next you already know video. Minhao! Oh, come on. Super weird. What's super weird? Minhao! <laughs> I wouldn't say it that way. Minhao. Better? Yeah, it's just the same. <laughs> You want to stop here? Can you eat dumplings? Yeah, yeah, let's eat some dumplings. So we actually